Good morning. Welcome to the Morning Touch. I'm Darwin Campbell. The Morning Touch is brought to you by the Chaplaincy for the Homeless and the FSBC in Glendale for your encouragement. Today we want to focus on what so many people are dealing with. So many people are dealing with stress and trouble uh, during this time when we've had political turmoil, upheaval, change, and you topple that with COVID-19. It's made it very difficult. What I want to do is share with you a passage from Psalm 69. And what that passage does, it talks about David during his time of distress and the power that he turned to. Let's look at Psalm 69. Listen to what David was going through. Save me, O God, for the water has risen above my neck. I have sunk in deep mud, and there is no footing. I have come into deep waters, and a flood sweeps over me. I am weary from my crying. My throat is parched. My eyes fail looking for my God. Those who hate me without cause are more numerous than the hairs on my head. My deceitful enemies would destroy me, for they are powerful. Indeed, in Psalm 69 verses 1 through 4, David is under stress. David within himself, looking at himself, has no answers. He is in pain, in hiding. He is wondering how he's going to make it. As a matter of fact, he looks and he sees and he describes. He says, my water is risen above my neck. I'm about to drown. I'm in deep mud with no footing. I'm sinking. A flood sweeps over me and my throat is parched. I yell and no one hears me. You know, that might describe you today. Amidst COVID-19, amidst unemployment, amidst troubles and problems, marital pressures, struggles, you're feeling like David in Psalms 69, that you just don't know where to turn, who to turn to. You don't know what to do. You don't know where your next step will take you, or even if you're going to make a next step. You may feel depressed, frustrated. You may feel suicidal. You may feel like throwing up your hands and giving up. I say to you this morning, listen to David. Do not do that. Turn to the right source. Open up the pages of the word of God and pour out your heart before God in prayer. Get down on your knees and appeal to God. Open up and bear your soul. Make it heartfelt, soul-stirring, sincere, and emotional like David. His description brings tears to my emotional eyes. And it brings me to a very humble position knowing that this is a man who was under stress and duress and he teaches us how to handle it. He teaches us where to go. Right now, if you're under any type of stress or duress, go to Psalm 69. Read what David says in pouring out his heart to God. His enemies wanted to destroy him. He was being crushed mentally, physically, financially. He was in hiding. He feared for his life. He turned to God. He talked to God, the creator, the sovereign, powerful, omnipotent, omnipresent God, Jehovah creator. David says, Lord, rescue me. Lord, answer me. Lord, draw near to me. You know, those are three very important statements from verses 13 through verse 18. 
Lord, rescue me. You know, the Lord waits for you to speak to him, to talk to him. The Lord waits for you to pour out your heart to him in your time of stress and duress. When you have nowhere to turn, nowhere to hide. And it seems the world is against you. All the pressures are on you. Now is the time, friend, to get out on one knee. Ask the Lord for an answer. And ask him to rescue you from the miry mud. Ask him to help you so that you don't sink. Ask him to answer you so that he can bring forth his goodness into your life. Ask him to draw near to you. The key is be sincere in pouring out your heart and asking him for help. There are many of you out there who need that right now. Psalm 69 and David teaches us how to respond to the deepest, darkest challenges that we ever face. Whatever it is in your life, go to Psalm 69. God just says, talk to me. Talk to me. He says, ask and it shall be given. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door will be open unto you. Ask in faith. Seek in faith. Knock on that door in faith and God will answer you. He answered David. David requested to be rescued from the mire. God rescued him. David requested an answer for God. For goodness, he got it. David asked God to draw near to him in his humility and God came into his realm. My friends, nothing is hopeless. And if you are faced with challenges and struggles and turmoil and stress, don't give up. Go to Psalm 69 and see how David resolved his challenges and his stress. And then make an emotional, heartfelt, soul-stirring appeal to God to relieve your pressure and to help you out of your darkness. If you open up to God, he will extend himself to you. You know, the Morning Touch is brought to you by the FSBC in Glendale and the Chaplaincy of the Homeless. We hope that you've been encouraged, that if you are in pain and you are in stress, are you battling with the COVID-19 fallout? Please, turn it over to God. Call on Him to rescue you, to answer you, and to draw near to you. And then stand back and watch the results. God is a good God. He's waiting to hear from you. I hope, Justin, pray you've been encouraged. God bless you and keep you. And until next time, we'll see you again on The Morning Touch.